What's going on YouTube? This is B Hackett and this is my first video uh, semi opinionated on Madden Ultimate Team 13. I have had one one issue that I'd like to address and see if anybody else is having. It's not really an issue, it's just kind of annoying and that is uh, taking cards uh, from anywhere to pending collection. I feel like once you get your team established you have 50 plus players if you have any depth on your team that all those spaces are already filled up on your active and when you purchase a pack you don't want to use all those players but you may especially early on like right now you need a lot of those players for collections so in Madden 12 you were able to put those players into pending collections straight from when you buy the cards and this you can't have more than 55 active player cards uh, like in Madden 12 when you would rip a pack you could have let's say you had your 55 cards and you purchased a pack then you you would have over the limit but it wouldn't let you leave that screen until you get under the limit so you could throw some on the trade block some on the auction house and some in pending collection and not have any issues at all on this one it will not let you go over 55 active players so even if you have one open spot if you wanted to take that player to collection you have to take it from the reserve put it into the active slot and then put that player in the pending collection just as shown there um, it's a very time consuming process I don't see why they went away from when you bought the cards that you could put it straight in there I hope they can bring that back I think that would speed up the process a lot on these collections also be very careful when you're going in say you're, I'm, uh, I'm throwing a couple players in the Saints here I really have not got much uh, much work done on throwing these cards in collection as you see I have several hundred cards in reserve so this is going to be a very very time consuming process if they don't fix this problem uh, but if you accidentally clicked back one more time here it would take you all the way to the main screen of the collections and not just back to the teams so if you had say five players from five different teams and you backed out you would have to find that team again and go back in it's just very very time consuming I feel like in MUT 12 it was a lot quicker in that regard other than that I've really loved this game so far I have a really good team 96 overall already with a ton of 99's uh, I'll go through here and show you guys the quick stats uh, don't go real deep in the depth chart showing all the stats but compare and uh, you can pause if you like or just let me know what you think I'd like to know what players people are liking in the game so far I've only played a handful of games I've done a lot of the solo challenges really been liking that so far uh, I just had my first head-to-head -head game against an equal opponent and made him quit in the first quarter so that was pretty good I am looking to switch out Kurt Warner I'm not I throw the ball deep uh, and he has not very good throw deep stats but I've been liking that Walter um, in, the, in this video I switch out for the CJ2K but he uh, he's fumbled the ball a lot more than that Walter Payton did that Shannon Sharp is by far my favorite offensive player so far he's absolutely ridiculous and Dick Lane is my favorite defensive card he's made a bunch of plays and surprisingly I haven't looked at his hit power but he's forced several fumbles that I can remember I just got that mean Joe Green uh, yeah thanks for the trade on that I believe that's Dan but and uh, thanks Chuds for the Irwin Irvin sorry that Brooks I just got two for an extra card it's nice having friends that are ripping packs as well because I had a couple duplicates that I could trade real quick for other cards that they uh, they have duplicates of so it makes a nice trade off that get a little variety with all these new legendaries uh, there's an actual 92 Dion but he's a 99 as a kick returner because he's so fast and the Rod Woodson's also 99 surprisingly slow speed on Rod Woodson that's the top rated Chris Johnson I really like his speed just have to be careful because he will fumble the ball kinda reminds me of uh, like the Barry Sanders cards in Mutt 12 just really quick small quick back get you in trouble if you try to take too many side hits or awkward hits but thanks for watching I hope you guys are enjoying Madden Ultimate Team 13 as much as I am uh, hopefully they see this video and can possibly do something about those
collections make that a little bit smoother process. But yeah, thanks again for watching. Everybody take care. God bless. And I'll see you next time.